lifting people. The significance is very simple. I love this world. God the creator, God the creation are the same person. God the creator, the creation, we are all human beings, we are all his children. So I love, I feel that it is my bounden duty to give joy to people whom I love. And again, while giving them joy, I feel they are also giving me joy. My lifting up, the philosophy behind is this, I give joy to people and they give me joy at the same time. We are here on earth to give joy to one another. When I lift, I do not think of anything. By the grace of God, I know how to silence my mind. In, when I don't want to allow any thought, either good or bad on it, I can stop them. I can block it. Like this is my our museum. I, if I do not want anybody to come into the museum, I just bolt the door. I do not allow. So if we silence, if we can silence the mind, we get enormous capacity. The thoughts weaken us. Wrong thoughts weaken us. Again, good thoughts strengthen us. But to have no idea what kind of thought will, in, will enter into our mind. So best thing is to silence the mind. It, for a few seconds, or sometimes it is four seconds, sometimes ten seconds I take, I just shut the mind. And then when there is no mind, I can go beyond the mind. Beyond the mind is the unlimited energy. It's in, according to my receptivity, I, get, I lift human beings and heavy materials. It depends on how much hunger you have for God's grace to depend upon us. Here, I will not pray to God. I will never, never pray to God. I have never prayed to God to make me an excellent athlete or sportsman or an artist or weightlifter. As a matter of fact, I disliked weightlifting vehemently when I in my um, when I was in my teens I thought only the brainless people will live to it if the body becomes heavy mind will become dull and everything so I had that wrong theory whichever thing but here God says no the body the physical and the spiritual can easily go together so here he wants to prove to the world that it can go together as far as my mind is concerned, I have written over thousands of books, over 1,500 books. So there I have shown my mind. My mind is not lagging behind my spirituality. So it, I pray to God for His will to be fulfilled in and through me. This is the secret. So now this moment He wants to ex express Himself in and through me as an artist, as a poet, as a writer. And, and as an athlete and um, bodybuilder, weight, weightlifter. So I do not pray to God to give me this, to give me the He gives me capacity and tells me from deep within, do this for certain years, do this for that, that kind of thing. I, I implicitly obey His command.